Good morning, students. So we have done our lesson number one, and we will have just a recap of lesson number one. Recap means revision. All the topics we will see once more. All the important topics we have done in lesson number one. So the first topic we have done it was our introduction. Introduction means knowing everything about important about us like what is your name how old are you where do you live in which class do you study in which school do you study what is your father's name what is your mother's name and their uh, mobile numbers so all these are related to our introduction these are the basic details we should know about ourselves so do you know all these information about yourselves okay very nice now moving on the next next topic our friends we have many friends in the school and we also make friends in our homes so friends are our best part of our life because we play with them we share our feelings with them when we become very happy we uh, spend time with your friends and when we become also sad then we go to our friends to share our feelings okay so in this chapter we also learned how can be we a good friend how can we do nice things to our friends and among all our friends there is always one of them is our best friend and best friend is the person with whom we like to spend our time the most right so you should know your best friend's date of birth your best friend's hobbies and all this after this we discuss about our hobbies what are hobbies hobbies are the things we like to do in our free time if we maintain hobbies in our life we will never get bored right because we have something to do in our free time then we will be doing those things in our free time and we can engage us in a very good manner so we can maintain different kinds of hobbies like painting drawing gardening and moving in the nature spending some time with the nature watching trees and flowers watching birds and animals in this way if we know how to spend our time with the nature it is also a very good hobby and you can take care of uh, your little siblings in your homes you can help your mother um, in household work okay so you can develop these kinds of hobbies these hobbies are very creative and it will uh, develop your personality also right so after this we discussed about our important document which we carry every day to the school and what is that that is our id card yes right so id card is the document which has some important details about us with the help of id card our teachers can identify us very easily so we should carry our id card with us every day so all the things we have done in this chapter i hope you enjoyed and you have understood the chapter now we will meet soon uh, for the next chap uh, for the next chapter goodbye